Hello class of 2020, or should I say, our most recent PSU alumni. Congratulations on your graduation. One of the great joys of my career is getting to know you over the time you were at Penn State and then seeing you off at graduation. This year, I am all dressed up with nowhere to go. It is still a time to celebrate what you've accomplished in IST at Penn State. I have been so impressed with your class. You are creative, you are problem solvers, and most importantly, you are incredibly kind and inclusive. Now is the time to go off and share all of these amazing gifts with the world. I'm so excited and so proud of every single one of you and what you've been able to accomplish in your academic programs. I wanted to offer you my heartiest congratulations on your success in completing your degrees here in the College of IST and at Penn State. I'm very, very proud of all of you. I'm particularly proud because, as you probably know, uh, this is not just your university, this is my university. I am also a very proud graduate of uh, the Pennsylvania State University. So this degree has always meant something to me, and I hope it means a lot to you. And this is a big day for you. Congratulating all of you that are such a big part of my life. It's a lot of pride in what you've been able to accomplish with it, everything going on, uh, being able to apply yourself, and be able to accomplish this goal such as this. We're so happy to share in the excitement of your graduation day, and we're so proud of you. Your graduation is different this year. Granted, we know you want to be here and we want you to be here. But this virtual graduation is very momentous. You are the first in the history of Penn State to have a virtual graduation. This is an occasion you will be able to tell your children and your grandchildren about. It is a momentous occasion and needs to be celebrated just as if we were all here together. I don't think I've ever participated in a new, more unique graduation ceremony. It's not exactly the way we would have drawn it up in the playbook and uh, one day we'll be able to uh, get together again as a group and uh, reflect on this uh, a little more uh, formally. But until then, uh, work hard, play hard, and uh, live hard. You're ending your time with us in a situation that none of us could have imagined, but you have persisted and courageously. We know your senior year wasn't what you expected, but we know you'll do great things. There's always an opportunity to think more clearly about how we move forward. And really, you guys are gonna be the ones who get to make those creative, advanced and really innovative decisions on how we as a society move forward. And I could not be m more excited and have more faith because the things that I've seen from your class are just remarkable. You are an unprecedented class for an unprecedented time. Go into the world and do well, but more importantly, go into the world and do good. If I can give you one piece of advice on the next part of your journey as an emerging professional, or going on to graduate study, it would be to believe in yourself. I know that these are unprecedented times and you're being called on to be flexible in ways that previous generations have not. But what I would say to you is that you will become and emerge stronger from this time, that you have it within you to go on and do great things. And we have every expectation that you're going to impact the world in a positive way. You're going to be making a lot of hard choices in the years ahead, and here's my advice. First, don't be afraid to ask questions, no matter how silly you think they might be. Two, make sure you get a good night's sleep before you make any important decision. And three, when in doubt, follow your gut. You got this. Our world is changing rapidly, but we have confidence in you facing the challenges. When you're successful, look for a bigger challenge. When you meet failure, extract everything you can from it. All of your experiences are assets towards a brighter future. My advice to you as new alumni is to network, network, network. And one of the best ways to do that is through the Alumni Association. And you know, there are Penn Staters everywhere. So wherever you end up, don't lose your Penn State connections. They're gonna be very valuable to you as you move forward in your career. As you transition to the next phase of your life and career, do it with both confidence and humility. Confidence that the completion of the rigorous requirements of your degree have given you the personal skills to accept whatever challenges may come your way in the future. 
and humility to realize that especially in fields as rapidly changing as ours, we don't know everything, and we are always learning. Remember to be a lifelong learner. The skills covered here are diverse, but the most important is how to identify and answer questions that need answering. Your education here at Penn State might be over, but every day there's something to learn. So don't ever stop learning. Stay motivated and enthused and excited about the possibilities of every day. Uh, congratulations, but as you go through life uh, and in, into your work uh, uh, life, you should remember one thing and one thing above all, take your jobs, but not yourselves, uh, seriously. And remember that laughter is the best medicine. Graduation is a beginning, and your charge as the class of 2020 is to understand the fragility of humanity and embrace how you're prepared to contribute to society's growth and understanding and its resilience. You've proven that you are resilient and this will go a long way to making you successful in your careers. As you move on to the next big step in your life, be kind, be yourself, and you will do great. I uh, just wanted you to know that I'm so proud of you and to know that the sky is the limit. So continue to spread your wings and soar. It's been a privilege for us to be part of your journey. Even though we can't join you on commencement day, we're with you in spirit. Congratulations on your graduation and best wishes for your next adventure. Yay! Yes. Congratulations! All right. Graduating class of 2020 is that time that I look forward to. And uh, I want to share this moment with you, and I want to join in this moment with you. And I want to hear you when you actually say this. So I'm going to give you something that I know you've been raring to say for four years now, and now's the opportunity to do it in this moment. All right, are you ready? Here we go. We are. We are. We are. We are Penn State.